crystal clear water filtering through the sandbanks in the Black Umfalozi River. It's a quiet afternoon. You hear a little juvenile rattling cysticola chirping its message out to the world. And there, far down by the riverbanks, through the trunks of a tree, another creature with a trunk, a wonderful African elephant bull, just standing engaged in whatever pondering process elephants will when gazing at rivers. And here another bull, a rhino bull, square-lipped white rhino. I always marvel at this form and just watching this creature with this astounding horn that grows out the front of its face, almost like a, a rudder in the front by which it aims its life in a way, scents us and tries to work its way closer and closer just to peer through the shadows to get a better look at what it is that observes it. Wonderful prehistoric animal, this. And then the sun sets behind the silhouette of a knobthorn trunk in the west. And in the east the moon, one day shy of full moon, rises behind another knobthorn tree trunk, such as the reality of Africa. Africa.